Welcome back, my friends, to more Let's Play Gran Turismo 5. This is Sky Hurricane, and we are still in the Japanese Championship, and uh, we are on the fourth race here at Monza. And so let's get right to it. We're driving our golden Subaru Impreza uh, 2002, I think, or 2000. I don't even know. Anyway, we are ready to roll, ready to win. So far, we have won every race easily. Well, not easily. I did, we did have trouble on Fuji, but we won. We pulled through. We pulled through. We're pretty much equal performance as these other cars here. I didn't want to overpower, you know, because that would just be boring. Miles the speed of Tenza. What are you doing in my way? Tell you what, that of Tenza is getting down. Gotta love Monza, though. But yet, once again, a very long track. This track does have a lot of nice straight high speed areas, high speed sections. <laughs> I love cutting across that. They make it real easy too because you don't lose any speed or traction when you're doing it. I just did this track in the Gallardo Trophy with my Lamborghini Gallardo. Exact same track. This car isn't quite as good on the curves as that Lamborghini, though. The heck, I am kicking them, though, ain't I? I'm surprised. This car ain't quite as fast, either. Of course, it has half the horsepower. A little more than half. Thing. What's happening to them? They're not keeping up very well. <laughs> I'm kicking them worse on this one than any other track. We do have the same tires and everything. I did not change. I did not change anything between the last video and this one. That kind of sucked. Yeah, I bet they gained on me a little bit there. Yeah, they're definitely a little closer now. Yep, another long race. Another long race. I don't know what track the next one's on. Probably Suzuka. Because I think it even is a Japanese track. I'd be surprised if it wasn't used for this championship. Somebody's got passed. Oh, I see the standings changing between 6th and 7th. I better watch and pay attention to the road and not fly off. <laughs> oh, yes. Yeah, I always... I'm liable to uh, kill them on this track, you know, using that little shortcut. But then, you know, when I run off the road right there, that's going to counteract it, counterbalance. And thus, we're right where we were. Got a little mods. Nice. I like this forest in this track. And there's a bridge there, too. An overpass. This, uh, this must be right under a freeway or something. I can't wait till I do that one really hard challenge on this on this track and win the best reward in the game that you can win. And what's funny about that, I don't think the reward for a gold is any better than bronze, aside from you just getting more experience, you know, and more uh, credits. I don't think the reward is really any better. Come on, y'all. You're not keeping up very well at all. You're kind of making me disappointed. No, nah, they're really not. I kind of like it. Nice, peaceful stroll through Monza. This car has really good brakes. Wow. Braking is one of this car's forte, I must say. 
for four Titans. Now, except right here, I always break too late right here. Oh, that was better. That was much better. Let's see how much we can kill them on this track. Good, we didn't fly off into oblivion. That's nice. Never want to fly off into oblivion. Because it's not fun. I don't know, it might be fun. Which probably would be. Probably would be. Still wouldn't be effective, though. But can't deny it would be fun. Crap, I kind of messed up there. Not too bad though. They're trying to keep it. I'll tell you what, we got a little gap now. Two more laps to go. Exiting speed is more important than entering speed. I think we exited well even though we didn't enter very well. Cisco or something. That actually was the best lap. Uh, they did gain on me a little bit because I didn't do that last corner that well. Well, that could have been a lot better. Oh man, y'all, they're gaining on me now. Whatever will I do? Whatever will I do? And I gotta say, as of the time that I'm recording this, I have uh, finished recording a uh, Tie the Tasmanian Tiger 3. Of course, I have no idea what part I would be uploading, you know, how that would coincide with me uploading this, you know, I have no idea. But I, I finished it today. 100%. I was quite pleased. Because it was very, man, I tell you what, it took me. I, I, it took me so long to find all those daggum picture frames. Y'all just don't even want to know. It took me six hours. It took me four hours uh, yesterday, or not yesterday, but the day before. And I had to take a break from it. I mean, who has time for that, you know? I had to take a break from it. I was about to go insane. This music is insane. Like I was going the day before yesterday. But yeah, I did it four hours, you know, on Thursday, and then, because we didn't have school, because it actually iced, it had uh, rained, you know, Wednesday night, and turned to ice, and, and so they canceled school, but then we had it Friday, because it kind of thawed out, and actually got into the 50s, you know, normal for this time of year, it's supposed to be in the 50s in Arkansas in January, you know, that's supposed to be, it's not supposed to be 25 degrees crazy weather we've been having or three degrees like it was a couple weeks ago oh gosh insane insane come on y'all you know I had a man I had a really bad lap last lap five seconds worse I'm still beating them Yeah, for one thing, I missed the bed right here. We're not going to do that again, though. I say that, but we may. Now we're almost done. We got this. 
Five out of five. And then be onward to the last race of this championship. This very long championship. Of course, there will be some that will be longer. 100% in this game is something. Oh, man. Uh, I don't even... I don't know if I'll 100% or not. I mean, I'm still seeking input on what you think on uh, me doing the endurance races. Especially like the Nürburgring, the 24-hour one. That would take me several days to uh, do that. And I'd, I'd probably just show the highlights, probably of all the endurance races. I think what I've decided, because I, I will do most of them. But the 24-hour one, I'm not so sure about. But uh, I'll probably just show like a montage, a highlight, you know, highlighting the events, you know. Or various points in the middle, you know, beginning, the middle, and the end of the race. Various points, you know exciting things that may happen. Oh well, the MR2 got second again. Then MR2's been kicking it. The Celica 98 actually got 10th. And Prezza got last. What happened in Prezza? Uh, the Tenza was only 8th on that one. What I expected is to get on all of them. <laughs> the Mazda Speed of Tenza has been doing pretty good. Kind of surprised me. Uh, oh, yep, Suzuka. I knew this race was going to have to be in it. Knew it. All right, well, let's do this. They have to give us five laps, too. Ugh. This is going to be so long, y'all. So long and painful. Nah, not too painful, but long. You know, I really never really liked the Suzuka track very much, but I think I've done it so much, you know, between Jarrett and Labonte stock car racing and between Grand Turismo 4 and Grand Turismo 5 here, that I've actually come to like it. Actually come to like it a little bit. All right, let's do this. Let's do this to it. Let's run off the road right off the start. <laughs> Well, I had an app earlier and I still got a piece of it stuck in my teeth. That's so annoying when it happens, ain't it? Doesn't that just annoy y'all when it happens? It probably annoys me, t uh, annoys, annoys you me telling you about it also. Oh gosh, this silly song. This is the silly song. Nah, this ain't the silliest. And our RX-7 so good on curves, you know. Yeah, we all have sports soft tires on, so I have no advantage on the tires. I had to itch. I know excuses are signs of weaknesses, but I really did. Come here, RX-7. He's way up there. I'm going to start driving better to catch him. Or her. Could be her. Could be a granny driving. Who knows? You have to watch some grannies these days, man. They get down driving their Cadillacs or BMWs, man. They will get down. They'll even run you off the road, man. If they're in a hurry enough to get to the grocery store or to the mall, you better look out. Do not get in their way. Whatever you do. Come here, RX-7. Oh, and I just had to do that, didn't I? All right, let's drive like this. I can do better. The miles of speed of tens is getting down. Of course, you know, it starting out second really makes a big difference, you know, on what its final place is that it gets. Oh, this is, this really is not a good song. I don't even know what they're saying. A Ferris wheel? You gotta love that Ferris wheel. Nice hitch. Very nice addition to the side of this racetrack, I must say. Two and a half minutes. Oh, my golly. This is gonna be a long race yet. Why couldn't they just give you four laps on this track?
That's one thing I liked about Gran Turismo 1 is you didn't have any real long races like this. I mean, uh, the longest race you ever had besides the endurance races was a uh, five laps on special stage round 11. And I mean, that was only there were only two races like that in the whole game. You know, you had it frontwards and you had it backwards in the Toon Car Championship. You know, and even those didn't take as long as this did because, I mean, you could do a lap in a minute 50 seconds. Ugh. Of course, on the normal car championship, you know, it'd be a little over two minutes per lap. I mean, even if you had the Viper, which is the fastest normal car in that game, you know, it still took over two minutes per lap. Your RX-7, I want you for supper. <laughs> I could have gone a little faster there. I think I'm gonna drive the rest of the race this way because I excel better and I'm anxious to be done with this championship as much fun as it has been. Because we want to get on to bigger and better things. Oh, crap -omatic. Yeah, I drive better this way, don't I? Lord have mercy. Apparently not much better. I think that Nismo Fairlight is getting down. Catching me. Oh, heck, it's really catching me. <laughs> oh, man, who, who said I can't drive? Come here. I'll tell you what, I really caught him. I'm going to draft you this time. You are not getting away. I'm doing so bad on this race. Yeah, this track is very, very hard. I mean, several real bad corners, man. And if you run off on them, whoo. That sand messes you over. It's not like Monza, you know, where you can get off a little bit and, you know, be just perfectly fine. Of course, Monza has a couple bad spots too, but not as many as this one. This track is full of them. One's right there, you know. And actually, if you if you do that at the right angle, you could actually take that as like a shortcut. You know, you could get off the road a little bit and as a shortcut. Well, all my tires turned red there. I was really turning it sharp. Okay, this is a little better song. And what they were playing. I don't know if you can hear it or not. I try to make sure you can hear the audio. I don't know if that's a good or bad thing. I mean, you know, it's not like I have many comments saying, oh man, the game audio. You do such a good job on the game audio. I mean, I never really hear that. I've never heard it actually. Now, sometimes I think I have heard, uh, like when I first started LP in uh, my first project, the game audio was way too loud and you couldn't hardly hear me. I mean, you could, but it's kind of difficult. The game audio was way too loud. To, of course, I had no clue what I was doing then. And I think I did have this sporadic comment one time that, uh, oh shoot, what happened? It was on my Super Mario World project, which I still have not finished, you know, as of the time of this recording. Hopefully I will have finished it by the time this is uploaded, but, uh, my buddy Tim and Turner, he hadn't been able to record, and it's kind of messed us over on that, but, but yeah, on that project, uh, there wasn't a way for me to record the game audio at first. 
the way I did it, you know, if I did record the game audio, it was going to lag so bad. So I had to uh, resort to a different measure and not record it. And so I added the game music. You know, I just added the soundtrack in it, man. It was so time consuming. I had to download the soundtrack and then edit it in there. And all man talk about very time consuming process. But then when I changed it back, whenever I finally started recording the game audio, you know, I started recording a different way I figured it out and uh, it seemed like they liked it the other way better. For, you know, liked it the other way better. So I, I don't know, I think they said something about it not being loud enough. They wanted to hear the game audio. So I did uh, raise it. I mean, nothing else to say it. I don't know if it was good or not. But you know, rarely get comments about that. I rarely get many comments anyway. Sad. I love comments. I always reply. Give me comments, please. I tell you what, I'm staying just ahead of them. I mean, I'm not really getting away, and I'm not really, uh, they're not really eating me either. Hey, MR2 is getting down on this one, too. Can the MR2 get second again? It, heck, it is. There goes the RX-7. Man, that MR2 is good. I need to go buy me one of those. That's one of my favorite cars, anyway. I need to go buy me an MR2. Those are some cool looking cars. One point seven seconds. Last lap. This long race. This long championship that has taken three videos to do. There will be many more long ones, I'm afraid. Yeah, I think, uh, like I was saying earlier, I think when I do the endurance races, though, it'll be like a montage where I saw the uh, highlights from from the uh, right from the race. So I don't know how that will go. Come on, RX-7. You know you want to pass. I'm putting like a granny. You know you want to. Let's drive like this now. Come on, MR2. You're so close. So close. Poor RX-7 just couldn't take the heat, could it? But I still think the RX-7 should get second for the overall championship standings because the MR2 actually got sixth on one race. Poor thing. It's definitely got my beat on cornering, I know that. Oh dang, he's eating me now. I don't like that. Yeah, I did that better last time. I let you gain on me too much last, last lap. And no, you are not passing. You can forget about it. I think you are, but you're not. Forget it. I'm winning this race. Uh, no way I'm doing this track. If I had to do this track again, I would... I would pick like that Toyota Minota or something super fast, you know. <laughs> we won, we won. Now Sylvia got last in that one. You look at that. The tens have got seven. And what were our what are our overall standings? I must see. Yep, the RX7 was second. By 25 points, the MR2 was third by, he lost by quite a bit. Fair Lady Z S Tunes, fourth. 
Oh, uh, last was one of my favorite cars, the Celica GT4. Only 15 points, poor thing. Uh, I don't know why I'm analyzing the standings. You know I've lost it when I'm doing that. Get us another trophy. Wow, 208,000. That's nice. Very nice. And there goes the MR2. I'm going to have to buy me an MR2 if I ever see one. That's a good car. I don't know. There are tons of cool cars in this game. All right, and Gran Turismo All-Stars is next. What is this like? Oh, another championship. But these are slightly shorter, except for that one. That one's going to be longer than anything I've just picked. <laughs> All right, everybody. We're going to stop right here. And, uh, well, after we see what car we won. This is a really long video. We won the Gran Turismo 350Z RS. Nice. Oh, I like those 350Zs. Let's see what this baby looks like. And we'll almost be done with the Expert. And then we'll move on to the Extreme. Oh yeah, that's sharp. Wonder what year that is. Wonder if this was a tuner. There are a lot of... There are a lot of Nissan 350Zs that are tuner cars that have been tuned up. I think I already have a couple in my garage. Let's see here what exactly we got. Oh yeah, it has to be a uh, tuner. 350, 360 horsepower. Because I know it doesn't start out with that much. Let's see what you look like. Oh yeah, nice. Very nice looking. Well, everybody, I think this is long enough. We're going to stop right here and hope that you enjoyed this part. Please like, comment, subscribe, and share if you haven't done so already. And I want to thank you very much for watching. Have a super awesome day, y'all. Goodbye.